Disclaimer, this process will delete your system drive. Please create backups of everything that matters to you. Hello and welcome to my guide on how to install NixOS with GNOME and using BTRFS with LUKS encryption. You will see that you can change it up by using another desktop environment, file system or leave the encryption out. I will get into details once those steps are reached. Please create a bootable USB installer with a tool like Belina Etcher and the NixOS ISO. Let's get started. At this step you can select the installer language, I leave it at American English. Next. Here I select my location which will also be used in the NixOS configuration file later on. Please select your keyboard layout here and change it to the one you prefer for your setup. We type in the username, our super secure password and be advised to use more secure settings as I did. I can highly recommend to have a different password for the administrator and select a secure password in the first place. Now we select our desktop environment, and here are all the options we can select in the installer. Other options are available if you install them manually, but this should cover most people. For this install we select GNOME. We select to allow unfree software to be able to install applications like Discord and the likes. As this is a virtual machine the partitioning options are a bit different although for our purposes we just select manual partitioning. We need to create a new partition table and select GPT. Now we create the EFI partition the swap partition and our system partition. Next and install. I will skip the video until the end of the install process. As the installation process is done now, click on restart now and the system will boot. At boot up we get prompted for the password to unlock our encrypted system. Now we just need to log in. In the next video I will show you how to add packages and what you can do with the configuration file. I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.